Hi! So I completed another collection. Finally, I'm moving with my Super Junior collection. And this video is going to be about KRY Super Junior's first subunit. Um, so here's their Hyena OSD CD. Hyena or something like that. How to pronounce it, I'm not sure. Then they released their first Japanese single not even a year ago. Promise you only CD. Promise you CD plus DVD. End of version. And they also had two special concerts in Japan. And the first one which was um, in some in the summer in 2010. And the second one end of, end of 2012. Uh, the special winter concert. These are unofficial DVDs. So basically these are the things what you can get with KRY really in them. So they had a lot of other OSTs, but you don't really get them in it. I mean, you get their voices like in one song. And why is this one special? Mm, well, they are on the cover. I mean, that's already more than the others. And also they are not only singing one OST on it, but I believe two and Kian also has a song on it. So. And also tracks. So for tracks and KRY, this is like, yeah, this is their OSD. Is the spine? And yeah, this was originally only an OB, but I cut it and then put it back because then the drama things were behind this. So this is now the back of my CD. Here's the um, track list: The Night Chicago Died, which, which was also performed in Super Show, the first Super Show. And yeah, the one I love. These are the two KRY songs. And there is Kihyun's solo. I believe that's Kihyun's, yeah, Smile. And then the couple of track songs and others. So it's not a really long OST CD, but yeah. And this is a Taiwanese version. Well, and that was it actually. So you open it up, you get CD, behind it again, the girl. And then here's lyrics paper and inside this, you only get pictures of the drama, so like none of the KRY members or something. But it's really nice that at least like in the Taiwanese version they are on the cover. In the Korean version, um, the drama, the actors are on the cover, so... Actually, which is like not normal, I think. I mean, they are not the ones who are saying it. Oh well. You can't really decide who should be on the cover of an OST CD, so yeah. And this is like what you could also get from KRY. Like this is was my main, one of the most important OST CDs I wanted because they participated in more than just one song. There is another one which is Keep Beat, which I want, but I'm only gonna get that a lot later. So then move on to their first Japanese single, Promise You, since they are not really going to have stuff for a long while now, because, well, the song is in the army. So, yeah, if you open it up, you get the black CD, because the only CD one is the black one. It's actually a really nice single, um, better than the normal Super Junior ones before this, so... Those re don't, didn't really have photo books, just lyrics, paper sometimes, and that was not nice. Only KRY and Donkey and Unyak had them, focus on it. So there is this small photo book, but these pictures are amazing, so... How blonde is song. Some more lyrics. Yeah, this also has an MV which was released when Hero was on the DVD. So, yeah, and there's the credits. That's all you get in the only CD, but still, I think this is nice compared to other Japanese things. So, And there is this one which is like a really creative packaging and I did not expect this from Japan. This is the white version, the CD plus DVD one. They really like the back, like all this stuff, I don't know. It's very really nice. This is quite heavy and thick, like, um, doesn't close entirely, but it doesn't move, so it's nice. So, yeah. Yeah, okay, so. 
Here's the CD, white, and the DVD is white as well. And some credits. And then you take this out. And there's a little plastic slip thingy which keeps them together. And here is the lyrics booklet. So some lyrics, some lyrics here too. But if you open it up you get again one picture per member, which is also really nice. I don't know if how was it? I think it was like this. Yeah, it was like this. And here it is white because you need to put that behind this because then you get this thing which is like the three members and if you fold it out you see that the, each member is in one plastic page which is like really nice I mean uh, there's cube by stuff in the middle so just by folding it you get the entire thing how was that? yeah like this there are some dust on it, like I don't know when did it get because I'm not taking this out. Just somehow it's on it. So, so that's how you got this thing. So this is really nice. You don't expect stuff like this from Japan usually. I think they really made a good thing for them, which is really nice since they could only have this one. Apparently they had a mini album thing in Korea. At least Kihan, that's what Kihan said because they performed the song from it on, on the first Super Show 5 in Korea. And he said that it's from an album. But they are not going to release it because there is no Ye song. Ugh. And here's the uh, version. Oh yeah, I forgot the cards. Okay, so in these two, on the CD and the CD plus DVD, you could get one out of six photo cards. I only have half of those because I will tell it later. So, oh, so here's Yesang, Ryabok, and Kihan in age order. These are the far view photo cards, and these this actually looks like it's a set because uh, yeah the and there's the back because the Yesang close up is horizontal and the Ryabok close up is shows his uh, the profile of his face. And like it's a bit messy, but Kihans is a really nice card, so I just eh, I don't know, like don't really like it that much, so that's why I only collected these. These are all Japanese press, by the way, and those two versions also exist in Korean version, and it's just a bit different. Like you get totally the same things plus a Korean lyrics thing and same cards. Just the coloring can be a bit different. That's all. And then here's the uh, version. Here's the back, also really nice. They are pretty. And this is the brown version. I don't you. You might see it's black, but it's actually brown. And it has a different different DVD track list. So yeah, there is another type of mu uh, Promise You music video. And you open it up, and you get the brown CD. Now you can see that it is brown. So yeah, the CD is brown. Behind it there is nothing really, so... And... There is also a calendar thingy, which I don't like to move actually, so... Plus, I'm gonna, like, after the year ends, I'm gonna, like, put that in my photo card binder when I get eight pocket sleeves, because they are a bit wider than, or taller than photo cards, like, I don't know. So here's the cover for the book thingy. Again, these artistic pictures and then blonde yes I <gasps> love this picture of Rayvok. I just really like how his hair is done here. Again, it's very really pretty these other pictures too. And then I love this picture of Kion. He looked really nice here. And then some extras, so not only these are the photo card pictures, something like those. Um, yeah, this is a photo card picture, and this as well. Uh, the big jacket card picture, I believe it's like this. Kihan something. It's really similar. No, this one. So the Reebok one, the Kihan one, and the Yesong one looks like this, and that's a jacket card. Only three of them. I didn't keep mine um, because. I don't know, I didn't, I should have, I don't know, 
I'm fine without it, but yeah, then I don't have all of them and just, uh, yeah, just don't know. So, <laughs> so I didn't end up with a Promise You jacket card from the Elf version, but somehow I don't feel like I need it that much as I, I have a lot more important cards so, to get. So. so this was the Promise You single. These like to stand, that's why I like jewel cases, they stand easily, but they also move too easily, so yeah. And then, um, move on to the concert DVDs. These are unofficial, both of them. So yeah, this also has Songmin and Donkey featuring. In one song they are both there, in Heartquake, Unyak is the one rapping, uh, Unyak, I mean Donkey. Like, all the titles are in Japanese. I would know them if I would be watching them, so... Uh, but I watched it in the summer and I don't remember exactly. And there is a song which only features Songmin. So there is one with only Donkey, one with only Songmin and one with both of them. I believe. And there are also solo stages for all the three of them. So, yeah. I don't know why the sticker is here, but yeah. It's a simple DVD case in the inside. Again, the same picture. Spine is the same as well. And then this picture is the same. And if you open it up, on this side there is nothing. But there is the DVD. So yeah, not much to it, but it's an unofficial thing and you get the concert. And yeah, this was, uh, usually in Japan they air it on TV, so there are these unofficial DVDs. The qualities are just as good as the official DVDs. I think they are just not official and they don't have any for the book and stuff like that. So yeah, obviously there is nothing behind this one. And yeah, this is their first concert. Uh, it was after Bonamana was released, so there are the Bonamana songs. Uh, yeah, and Raybox solo is the one, one fine spring day, so Pomnal. Yeah, that's his solo song, I remember. And then here's the special winter one. Uh, most of this is also on the Elf DVD, I believe, of Hero. Like, oh god, I watch these all at once, so yeah. This is also fan made, but it's different, and the feel to it is different as well. So here's the track list. Yeah, and yeah, and some of these are also on that one, and then. Other pictures. And then if you open it up here you have some stuff. This is really weird. And then here you have the CD. This is a different case as you can see. Like there is like these things which hold the CD in. Behind it there is a really soft fabric behind this. And there is also plastic protecting it and you get the same picture. So it's like the CD is gonna, the DVD is gonna be really well protected. And I think you can still find this on eBay, I think. Maybe not from the same seller, I don't know, but yeah. This is the special winter concert, like before um, this Promise You release. Yeah. I, you could check, like, if the songs are the same, so. Because they're, like, written in. English too, so there is, I'm pretty sure there is coagulation on this one too, so, yeah. <laughs> so really, this is all what you can get from KRY and of course a bunch of other OST CDs which are only, ha which only have one song from them, so, yeah. <laughs> but still, like, it belongs to Super Junior and like, yeah. So, yeah. Thank you for watching. Bye.